Hey guys, how's it going? Kuprian here. Today I'm going to give you guys my overall impressions of playing a Frozen Throne first like four to five days so you guys can kind of understand and have some expectations. Usually, I mean, I, I hate to be that guy that I've been writing stuff, but because I play a lot, I usually have a pretty good instinct on how most people will feel in about a couple weeks. So the way I feel right now is probably how you're going to feel in a couple weeks if you keep playing ranked mode. So what is going on in rank mode? We have a lot of decks. It's awesome time to play Hearthstone just because there's so many cool things that are possible. But there is one aspect of the game that seems pretty dominant, and that is the Druid class. Didn't really expect that, and it largely comes as a Jade Druid form. So Jade Druid got the new 10 cost card that's like instant hand reload they can play a lot more cards that are just like throwaways because they're gonna have this insane card draw they don't care about losing cards because they have jade out on the deck and because they have a lot more throwaway cards the jade druids play a lot more of a tempo game and yes you know blizzard put in that six mana hard counter to jade druid but really it doesn't work very well i played that card i played the geist in like i don't know like many different decks and honestly, most of the time I played the Geist, I lost. It's kind of weird, right? It has to do because just Jadru has so much more tempo now than it did before. And a six cost four six is like tempo suicide. So you have to like try to keep up, but you can't really know when druids are going to just, you know, shuffle Jade Idol and then draw a whole bunch of Jade Idols and then dump them on the board all over. You just... You just can't know that for sure. To pick the spot where you play the Geist, also have it in your hand when you need to play it. You can't play two of the card. It's just a bad counter, and this deck does seem a little bit out of control. The Druid Hero card also helps us along. While I think the Druid Hero card looked like one of the worst, certainly is one of the worst if you really compare it, it really fits in the J Druid deck very well because in the late game, all the J Druid wants to do is gain as much health as possible. So three armor return, well, that's pretty good. Uh, if, if that's all it does, and honestly, that's all it does a lot of the time, that's pretty damn good for a Jade Druid. And one of the main decks that actually beats Jade Druid is Aggressive Druid, largely because they also run that 10 mana card that draw a whole bunch of cards. So the meta is kind of shaped around this. Uh, your deck kind of needs to be pretty good against Jade Druid, because otherwise you're just going to lose most of your games. And that basically leads to most people playing extremely high roll decks. So... Um, these decks can be fun, but they're not fun long term. You really build up frustrations. Uh, the other Today's other video, if you want to see, High Roll Priest. It is a pretty cool deck. You want to play a dozen games, you're going to have a blast. More than that, you're going to start seeing frustrations because win or lose is going to have, you know, its entirety based off of the Barnes effect, whether or not you have Eternal Servitude when you really need it to resurrect that gigantic minion that died. So, you know, the range of the decks capable of beating Jade Druid have an extremely wide range. And um, I think that overall builds into a frustrating meta over time. Now, of course, it's day four or five. And as I kept repeating, I think above all other expansions, Frozen Throne has the most cards with potential than any other. I just think a lot of that potential will be shadowed by the fact that Jade Druid is so, so dominant right now. Today I want to give you guys a game where really goes to show this. I really like playing Control X, and Control X do pretty well, but as you guys know, Control X don't fare so well against Jade Druid. I'm running the counters, but it's still so difficult to deal with that tempo now. Overall, Druid card quality is just so high, and uh, yeah... I think you guys are going to start feeling that sting in the weeks to come. For now, though, have a blast playing. Try whatever. Just expect a lot of druid on the other side of the board. Enjoy the game, and I'll see you guys tomorrow. I'm going to keep that just in case he's... It's pretty crazy. I mean, that is a lot of fucking druids. I 
I do have to go all in on the mountain giant, unfortunately. lose that next turn, so I might as well use it now. This one, but it's gonna be a really grindy game. Please, no second naturalize. Hmm. I think he got the card that discards top five, but he's afraid to use it because of uh, Jade Idol number two. Let's hmm. see if I'm right. I waits for no one. No, I'm wrong. Six cards. Me hungry. You yummy. Okay. I'm gonna save that in the spot where it saves more than two damage. Ripped mortal coil, jade idol, and the other naturalized. Okay, this is true. So when he's out of cards, he actually loses this time. And that should be crazy. When he runs out of cards, he's not going to shuffle 30 more cards in his deck. I, I, I don't know, maybe if I keep repeating it, maybe, I, maybe it actually just sinks in. I think my hand is good enough to uh, d uh, basically stop the draw. Well, I don't need a heal yet. Jeez. That sucks. I could have cleared the board a few ways, but none of them were great. What to do? I just don't think uh, Hellfire is going to be particularly useful here. Like, the shit that he's spawning right now is going to be way bigger than Hellfire can deal with. Time waits for no one.
Still got Siphon, Nether, Shadow Flame. Oh, I don't, I don't think he's out of Jades now. Wipe face wrath. There's some way where I'm dead here. If I don't die here, I should win. Hmm. This is a really big put, really big push, and I can heal for six in the following turn. You haven't heard auctioneer. This guy's got natural eye. He's definitely got auctioneers. But, tangled well. uh, it's probably a pretty bad card for him to play right now. Oh wow. Okay. I'm almost out of cards. What did he even discard? Black Knight, Doomsayer. Why didn't he wait a turn? The only reason you wouldn't wait a turn is if you had a really good card in your deck you couldn't play out in the next turn. Mm. He's played Lich King. I don't understand. It seems bad. I think Deathwing came out one turn too early. But like My a really bad one played. turn too early. Oh wow. I'm out of cards. Thanks, God. He thought he was dead if he didn't trade. Masterful. Jade Druid! 